Um, I am just going to tell you a little bit about one of our lasers. This is the Pico Shaw laser. This laser hits tattoos at 755 nanometers. Uh, from a practical point of view, what that means from experience with the Pico Shaw, what I can tell you is that this tattoo removal machine is absolutely brilliant for treating skin types 1 to 3. It's very good for removing green, blue, and black ink. Um, what that means is that if somebody comes in and got a really stubborn green tattoo, really stubborn blue tattoo, but they're a lighter skin type, lighter skin types only, we can treat with this laser, and the blue will go away very quickly. It's also very good for black ink and faded tattoos. The Pico second lasers are way ahead of older lasers like Q-Switch, just because from experience with it, I can tell you that a treatment will fully go with minimal damage to the skin with, um, it can be anything from six to sometimes 10 treatments, sometimes a little bit more depending on the client and how dark and deep the tattoo was in the first place, but we are able to get those results with the Pico second lasers. So I think we're one of the only clinics in Europe that actually has the Pico short and the Pico Way. So if you want to follow me, I'm going to show you the Pico Way laser. slightly different company but this is the Pico Way laser. This laser um, hits tattoos at 1064 nanometers and then if I press this button also 532 nanometers. So what that means is that with this red one I can hit red, orange and yellow ink only on lighter skin type though I'm afraid. So if you are a skin type 4, 5 or 6, we will not be able to treat your tattoo if it's red or orange or yellow. Unfortunately, that will take too much pigment out of the natural colour of your skin. However, if you're a darker skin type, so you, you are a skin type 4, 5 or 6 and you have a black tattoo, the technology is now advanced enough that we can treat it using the Pico way. So if you're a darker skin type, it does mean that we can treat you. We do have to be careful with darker skin still because they're more likely to get pigmentation, which is where the skin goes a little bit darker in places or sometimes even lighter in places. Now, with experience with these lasers, we know how to treat the client depending on what happens and what we can do to rectify any pigmentation, but it's always a risk. Um, I would definitely recommend coming in for a consultation if you've got any more questions, but just be aware that if you're a dark skin type, we will not be able to treat the red, yellow, blue or green.